Let's take one more KTX exercise in SOLIDWORKS. Now see we have one front view, side view. There is one section view B. See from this direction. Then there is one auxiliary view. Okay. So we will start with this bottom view. 137 by 80 and the thickness you will see here 15 millimeter. Then there is one cutout. Uh, let's say 3 by 60. Uh, corner fillet R16 then make this center part circular R45 internal hole 35 angle 20 degree and distance 96 millimeter from here to bottom then there is a one 3 millimeter cutout see here 80 millimeter let's do this first now let's up apply front plane sketch activate here center rectangle now let's make this uh, distance 80 press tab key ok let me enter 137 now go to feature now I want to add material to this so you have to apply extruded boss base now keep end condition blind and see the direction it is going in perfect direction apply thickness 15 millimeter okay fillet now here fillet type constant radius 16 symmetry select one edge and it will show you this option so select first option and see all four edges going to select select this face sketch activate here corner rectangle press escape key now select this origin point hold shift key select this line apply here constraint midpoint smart dimension length 60 and depth 3 millimeter go to feature apply extruded cut i want to remove material simply here choose through all see look now let's check right plane sketch let me apply here construction line and draw vertical line and little taper circle activate line now connect from here to this end now select this one and this midpoint A smart dimension first length 96 5 millimeter okay trim entity power trim trim this half circle okay activate line go connect <clears throat> now hold shift key select these two line parallel relation fine now select these two lines perpendicular similarly I am going to apply perpendicular relation between these two lines and select this internal line construction now this radius 45 now this distance 3 millimeter angle the important 20 degree now we defined everything go to feature apply extruded boss base now here keep end condition mid plane so that material going to flow both side equally how much here 62 say ok now before going to apply let's make these ribs 18 millimeter 15 dia hole 22 corner radius and 140 millimeter 
then we will make these cutouts a t depth three and this all select this face sketch now let's draw a center line draw mid mid line is escape key to out now here drop down center point straight slot select the midpoint smart dimension 140 millimeter 22 let's add two circle now hold shift key select both circle and apply equal relation 15 millimeter is the diameter apply extruded boss base feature here keep end condition only blind reverse direction depth 18 millimeter apply now sketch now apply circle at center point how much radius diameter 35 into 2 apply extruded cut i want to remove material so here select through all see now again i want to one more cut out this time right plane sketch now here come down three point center rectangle okay let's choose center three point corner rectangle first point second point come down third point <coughs> okay center point select mid point now select this point and this point make concentric this is important select this line and this edge parallel let's apply distance 80 mm and distance from here to upper edge 3 mm okay it's already there 3 mm now upper side no need to define because uh, there is no material extruded cut now here apply through all both see material going to remove both direction now let's add this section view 8 8 36 now there is a c fillet 10 and 6 important fillets select this face sketch let me reverse corner rectangle okay okay let's draw two center lines vertical and horizontal so it makes our job easy select these two line and center line symmetric relation similarly select these two lines hold shift key center horizontal line symmetric relation okay now let's make these two equal okay no need to define equal this already equal because this is symmetry this one and uh, this one equal now let's define 8 mm 36 mm similarly this is also going to be 8 mm okay okay one more thing select these two collinear <coughs> but one more symmetric relation select this center line hold shift key these two okay symmetric relation look it seems fully defined okay apply extruded boss base 
Now here <coughs> we have more than one close profile. So in selected contour will activate and it, you have to select these three close up to body. Select this body. See. Apply. Now look here you can't directly apply radius uh, fillet. Apply fillet. Choose here face fillet. In face fillet 1, face 2, radius how much? 10. Okay. See here. Now here again. Face fillet. 6 millimeter let me select 1, 2. Sorry. Second face. See. I think we're done. Now let's apply some color to this body. It looks for aesthetic. I am going to change this color. Supposed to be we have to find the area of this, but let's okay. There is a problem. These are not going to coincide. That's why dimensions is not perfectly defined. Edit sketch. Okay. Here is the problem. Okay. connect with drag this line activate line and connect from here to this end horizontal select this one also horizontal ok it's fully defined now. Simply exit. Let's check. Now here we need to add a hole. See there is a distance 72 degree diameter 5. You will see 10 millimeter from here. Then this is the volume of model. Okay. Let's choose a plane. Select this plane. Make 10 millimeter inside. Okay. Select the plane. Is sketch. Draw a line. And draw a line from center point of. Center point. Angle. 72 make sure these line cross the body exit go to feature apply here swift cut here select circular profile diameter given 5 ok now click and hide now let's check the vol volume mass properties Look, 341989.06 cubic millimeter. Okay, this is what we need. Fine. Don't forget to share, like our video, and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in SolidWorks. Thanks for watching.